What's going on guys? Jay Fruzy Reviews here with another collection rundown. This time we are stepping pretty far back guys. We are going to Unlimited. So starting off with a Resurrection. Cheaper Unlimited card. Uh, followed by Blaze of Glory. Which I believe is Reserve List. It's one of the cheaper Reserve List cards. But nonetheless a cool card. And following up with Throne of Bone. So, very cool artwork there, guys. Love these old cards, especially when we start getting back to, all the way back to Unlimited. Uh, we have Ank of Mirshra. So, does two damage to and puts a new land into play. Uh, better get rid of this. And next we have an iconic card, Clockwork Beast. So, again, so many of these cards back in the day, especially Alpha Beta Unlimited. Man, I tell you, they're gorgeous. <clears throat> next we have an anti-card, Contract From Below. So, back in the day, you could actually do an anti and... I'm sure people who legit played it and had a Black Lotus or Mox as an ante, uh, yeah, that's really tough. But ante is banned now, except these cards back in the day. Oof, awesome stuff. So, moving along. Verdurian, or Verdurian Enchantress. So... Again, I think this is reserve list. I'm not 100% sure, but it's an awesome card nonetheless. I've never played with any of my unlimited cards. I'd love to because some of these are the more accessible, uh, very iconic cards from original alpha beta, but they're a lot less valuable. Um, still a pretty penny on them though. So next up, we have Fast Bond. Yes, Fast Bond. The Enchantment. Um, you may put as many lands into play as you want during each turn. Fast Bond it does one damage to you for every land beyond the first that you play in a single turn. <sighs> what people don't realize today, if you are very new to Magic, uh, back in the 90s, and just for the record, I started playing around 96, 97. I've opened a lot of older packs. I never got to open any uh, Alpha Beta Unlimited, anything like that. But <clears throat> the game was extremely broken. Um, because Richard Garfield, Wizard, the Wizards of the Coast, never thought that the game would take off like it would. I mean... When you start getting to the sheer print size, uh, print run of some of the Alpha Beta Unlimited, Unlimited was the highest, but still low. I mean, there's only 1,100 of each Alpha Rares ever printed, and mo probably you could say 40% are gone. Um, next, we have Howling Mine, another iconic card. Uh, each player draws one extra card during his or her draw phase for only two. Like I said, guys, broken cards just all over the place. Howling Mind. This one is actually a uh, pretty decent condition when I bought it. Um, it's a little more valuable as well. So, And last but not least, I believe this is the most expensive card from Unlimited that I own. It's a Raging River. Uh, this is reserve list. I know that much. And I'm going to say it's around $180, $200. I bought it in decent condition. There's some, a few issues towards the top. You can actually tell. But um, it's a beautiful card and another unlimited. So what are your thoughts, guys? Did you ever collect any unlimited cards? Um, some of your favorite unlimited? I know that... You know, Alpha Beta Unlimited, the ABU, they all had uh, very similar cards, except, you know, there were some obvious misprints in Alpha. They left out a few cards that they corrected with Beta. And <clears throat> I 
think there was one or two corrections that they instilled in Unlimited. But what are your thoughts, guys? Let me know. Uh, love to hear. But anyways, this is the rundown of my Unlimited collection. Uh, I have 10 cards. Next, we're going to get to Beta. So interesting to see what cards do I have from Beta and... What was the price point I actually paid for these uh, a long time ago? So, and we'll eventually get all the way to alpha. So, let me know in the comments, guys. What are your favorite cards from ABU? If you had to pick, I'm sure some people will pick Power Nine. Um, some will pick, you know, some iconic card like Dark Ritual or, you know, maybe a Wheel of Fortune or something like that. Sarah Angel, but let me know. So, hope everyone has a great day. Thanks.